All right, guys, uh, this is Andy VFX, and in this uh, video, we are going to take a look at uh, another free transition pack. This pack uh, is from Nitrom. Uh, this free pack includes more than 200 uh, transitions, and also these transitions are very professional. You can use these transitions inside corporate videos or even your YouTube videos. So without uh, further talking, let's take a look at a quick demo of few of these transitions and then uh, we can get uh, further details about this transition pack. Let's take a look at the demo. All right, guys, uh, hope you guys enjoyed that uh, demo. Uh, let's take a look at uh, how to download this uh, free transition pack. In order to download this, uh, you need to visit the link uh, in my video description and it will direct you to this uh, website. And here you can see uh, they provide uh, 200 demo transitions. Actually, uh, this transition pack uh, from the video hive author, uh, the Nitro. So this uh, complete pack includes uh, more than 2700 plus transitions and motion graphic elements. If you like to purchase the full pack, you can uh, purchase this. But if, before purchase, uh, if you like to uh, test these transitions, uh, you can download this uh, free demo pack. In order to get this, uh, you need to enter your something fair price for here. If you don't have money, press zero and you can click on purchase here. It will show purchase again because I have already downloaded this uh, transition pack. Uh, once you uh, do that, uh, they will send you a, a link uh, to download the transitions. Once you uh, downloaded the transitions, uh, it will look like uh, something like this, right? So here you can see the assets folder and uh, they also provide some uh, tutorials. But uh, I'll show you how to use these transitions uh, inside Adobe Premiere. So once you download this pack, uh, you need to go to the Adobe Premiere and uh, you need to import that uh, transition pack to Premiere. In order to do that, you can double click here and uh, locate the folder that transition pack includes and click on this folder and sorry, uh, Premiere project and click open. And uh, it will pop up this uh, import project uh, dialog box. Here you need to select the import entire project and make sure uh, check all these uh, check boxes and click OK. It will import the complete project to Adobe Premiere. And uh, when you expand this, so you can see uh, it includes uh, two folders. One folder include all the transitions and you can see it is uh, very organized and you can easily find the transition you need. And the another one is uh, adjustment layer. When you click on this uh, here, this is the one that we can use to change resolution. If you are, want to use this on a different resolution other than 1920 by 1080p, let's say you want to use this on an Instagram video. In order to use that, uh, first you need to uh, click on this adjustment layer and go to sequence settings and uh, change the resolution of the of your video. Let's say if you are creating this for Instagram, you can type the 1080 by 1080 and click OK. It will automatically adjust these transitions according to that resolution. But in this case, uh, we are going to use uh, the 1920 by 1080. Uh, we select that and click OK. Right. So we, if you're using on this 1920 by 1080 video, you don't have to change the resolution. This is the default one. Right, so now let's see how to use this. Uh, before you use this uh, transition pack, uh, you need to uh, do two things. First one is uh, you need to unselect this uh, video track number one like this, right? And also uh, turn off this uh, import nested uh, sequence as nest, right? This is turn on, this is turn off. You need to turn off this. And once you do that, uh, you can uh, go to this folder and if you like to do uh, this kind of preview you can do this uh, kind of uh, thumbnail preview like this by that way you can take a look at how the transition looks like and once you happy with the transition you can drag and drop this transition to the cut of your uh, video like this 
and uh, then you can preview this transition let's see full screen preview of that you can see these transitions are pretty cool you can use that on any kind of professional project if you don't like this uh, transition uh, you can uh, delete this transition by selecting this something like this and then you can go back to other folders let's go to the icon not the standard view and you can see there are they include various categories like this let's say something like shake and you can drag and drop this to the cut point and make sure your cut point align with the cut point of the transitions like this and you can release the mouse and also you notice that uh, it comes with the sound effect uh, that way you don't have to additionally add the sound effects to transitions if, if the transitions have uh, sound effects uh, that's uh, pretty cool right and let's take a look at the preview of this you can see so this uh, transition pack uh, include more than 200 demo transitions of course uh, if you like to uh, like this pack uh, you can purchase the full pack that will also support the original author he's very generous enough to uh, give this uh, free transition as a demo so hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you haven't subscribed you can subscribe and i'll be back with the next uh, video thanks